Hello there, this is Space Runner 5. Welcome back to episode 2 of our Confederate States Let's Play series where we're playing the Extended Timeline mod, where we are currently in the midst of our civil war against the United States. It is eight, currently 1864. Uh, the real civil war is not over yet, although it is definitely in its decline. Uh, however, for us, we are getting ready. Our turning point of the war has already occurred, and now we're getting ready to start to steamroll uh, the American armies left and right. Uh, we're actually getting ready to go ahead and reconsolidate all of our armies over here in Greenville. Just so we can go ahead and fight the uh, fight the Americans once more as they try and siege down Richmond, which we are going to defend to the best of our ability while we go ahead and continue to wait. Uh, I would actually like to go ahead and just recruit like 2k troops over here and just have them automatically uh, react by everything. So we are going to go ahead and slacken our standards real quick. Once more. Uh, 15,000 troops. Let's actually go for a couple stacks. Four. Let's go three stacks of two. Uh, that'll work. We're gonna go ahead and bring the entire uh, Confederate army right on over here. Uh, so we can go ahead and defeat this army over here that is trying to siege down Richmond. It has no leader. Uh, Julius Grant is still in the vicinity, except... But that's it. Is that the entire American army? No, they, they have they just got an additional 20k somewhere. They reinforced somewhere. Uh, war exhaustion is ticking up. We're actually gonna go ahead and boost our stab to get rid of any potential rebellions at the moment. Uh, Grant is in charge of that army. That's unfortunate there we're just going to stand here and suffer attrition okay that's fine americans are suffering significantly more attrition i would like to immediately just go defend immediately on richmond uh grant may not be able to even reinforce that army in time uh, which i would be for i want you guys to go ahead and pair up uh that'll work go ahead and go there That'll work. Richmond is still being defended. There is... Guys went south. That That's a 19k stack that's just going to get killed. Go merge. Just want to reoccupy all of our land. Texas. All of that. I didn't really care how you guys do it. You guys figure it out. I just need you guys to reoccupy this land. Uh, something like that will work. Uh, you guys are going to do the same thing. Uh, you guys hopefully will do it in some orderly fashion and not in the orders of my clicks as I sporadically click. Why is this in a different state? <laughs> <laughs> okay, interesting. I know some of those are union land, but that's okay. Uh, that's fine with me. Uh, you guys go and shift consolidate. We're at peak fighting potential. Wow, that stack just got obliterated. That was an army right there. We just defended Richmond. There's 900 troops there. We lost less than 1,000 troops. Fantastic battle for us. Uh, there are 100,000 Union troops over here, so that is something we do need to watch for. You guys are movement lock. We're going to go fight here in the woods. Another shift consolidate. Oh, you guys are a little bit faster than us, even. We were movement locked before you guys were. Uh, but Richmond is defended. The uh, fort there is being built. We're going to go do this fight against 19,000 troops once more. Empower was recovering a little bit. We are losing an ample amount of money right now. Mexico is sowing discontent in our land. That's unfortunate. Here we go. Look, another 18,000 for 1,200 troops. You guys are movement locked. I hope you guys will be as well. If Grant doesn't join you guys, you guys are dead. You guys are indeed movement lock goodbye 60,000 troops or another 40,000 troops got caught out this is where the americans uh don't do very well is on even numbers and well since we outnumber them it's even worse for them and we're automatically reoccupying our own land so fantastic if you do not have your capital we will go fight here in the woods even though we will suffer a negative one penalty on our dice that's okay we're gonna tell grant to get out of our land and you guys just continue on your merry way look at 17 percent. it's on low we do not have washington yet uh but we will someday uh, hills, uh, I still don't necessarily like that. I don't know, we'll go for here. Please stop. There we go. We'll go fight here. Fantastic. Fruit diplomats, yeah, we don't need any of that still. Not hiring any additional leaders. There we go. Dis oh, wow, our tact is still plus one. Morale's up by one. Discipline's up great numbers. Uh, yeah, this army is done. Look at that. Two-thirds of that army just got obliterated. 
I can now uh, comfortably go ahead and split this off into two stacks. This army can go ahead and siege down Washington. Give us the ticking war goal back, even though it is giving us a negative four penalty right now. Not too bad. And now it is time for us to go ahead and do the invasion of the north. Uh, who's, who's scared? I was not expecting the American army to only go there. We go fight here. Consolidate. You guys have low morale. Great. You guys, we have more artillery than you guys. We've been stealing your cannons. Fantastic. Uh, absolute wreck there. Uh, we don't have zone of control here, which is why I'm interested why they are uh, not running further away. I'm also confused. Ooh, that was a spider that just went dropped right in front of my face. Uh, hello there, spider. Uh, these go over there. There you go. Washington has fallen. Fantastic. You are down to 40,000 troops. All right, well, I guess we're just going to go ahead and continue occupying. You guys are sieging down the Americas. Uh, what are you guys doing? Okay, you guys are just doing your automatic redeploys. Fantastic. All righty, well, it's time for us to go ahead and take, in this war, we're going to take Maryland, Delaware, uh, West Virginia, because we are going to reunite the Virginia. Um, I don't know if I said this last episode, but West Virginia didn't exist before uh, the Civil War. It's actually just part of Virginia, and then they actually had a vote and they voted uh, not to join the... Uh... Did you just ally Mexico? You guys did not like each other. Just want you to know that. You actively hated each other. All right. uh, I guess we can go ahead and start going after some sieges. Uh, I don't, I'm not necessarily scared at the moment. We're missing 20, 26,000 men, though. But sh sh uh, this stack could actually ro run into some trouble. Looking at that. Okay. So we do see some troops. Um, you guys go ahead and retreat south. Go back to Florida. But imagine that they're trying to do some shenanigans over here. We're going to reconsolidate our troops over here. Get them going. We can uh, pay for that right now. War exhaustion continues to tick up. We are going to try and take Maryland, West Virginia, Unite Virginia. We're going to take Kentucky. And we're going to take Oklahoma to go and split the Union in half. That would make me happy. All right, so this looks, what, that's 40,000, 50,000, 65,000. This is two-thirds of the army right here. We are still missing troops. Do we slacken standards anymore? Don't necessarily feel the need to. There's a bunny outside today. It's the, it's the, uh, the hourly, or the daily different animal outside the window between foxes, groundhogs, bunnies, uh, cardinals. Like, you take your pick. You probably have it. All right, so we're going to go hunt this little stack. Our ticking war goal continues to tick up as we have taken Washington. I don't necessarily like the fact that we continue to take loans. We are going to have the Union go ahead and pay for a big chunk of that. And we're obviously going to go ahead and develop a bunch of our land as we go. You guys are trying to go to Nashville. You've not kicked us out here. Uh, who's over here? Mr. Green. As our movement lock, we'll go fight here into Bowling Green. And apparently not. Did you just change your leader to Leinster? Okay. Fair enough. You guys do you. 35,000. All right, there's Grant. Chilling. The American Civil War has gone on uh, longer than the original one has. Uh, how many men have died? 524,000 and 116,000. So it's a uh, two to one losses. Um, during the Civil War, it's about two to three uh, between Union and uh, the Confederates. Uh, so the Union has suffered significantly more losses to the base of Lincoln. Lincoln is still in office. Historically, they would have voted him out. You know. Washington has already fallen once more. Uh, that was a super quick siege. I think you probably did an artillery barrage. I had to guess. All right, you guys have 60,000 troops. We're going to we're gonna chill for a second. We're going to go and slack in standards a couple more times. Give me the manpower. I'm going to need it. Lose government reform progress. That's fine. I don't like the fact. Are we just going to have to take white peace here? I definitely want money. Money is something that I believe I deserve. For sure. Right, you guys go there. You're going to just go ahead and keep these armies relatively close. Grant is probably going here if I had to guess. Richmond now has their fort. Fantastic. Uh, so we should be uh, 
pretty easily defending ourselves. We are losing 132 ducats, excuse me, a month. Uh, reinforcements, probably. Yeah, 64 ducats. We're over our force limit, two for additional 18 ducats. Can I go and consolidate out some of this cav? Uh, there's definitely too much cav. I don't need that much. Could easily take this back if we wanted to. We got caught spying on the US. Oh, Washington already felt we're good. So let's just go ahead and do a full consolidate. Save us the cash. 18 ducats a month is pretty big uh, in terms of uh, losses. All right, you guys just go ahead and start sieging down the US uh, because it's time for us to do our invasion. We're going to come back over here and start clearing out some of these stacks uh, once we go ahead and deal with this. Not a fan. Is that a Merc stack? That is a free company. That is indeed a Merc stack right there is what I'm looking at. Wait for you guys to get movement locked. There we go. And then this army goes over here. Does it work? Yes, go over there. Carpet Siege. We've already ship consolidated. I don't know if we still have any sailors. Probably not. Probably no sailors left. Uh, the US has probably got to be going pretty broke here soon. Thank you for that. Uh, we did lose quite a few troops there, unfortunately. Alrighty. Um, the U.S. is going to be in a bad shape for this. You guys reconsolidate over there. That's fine. Uh, there is a 20k stack over here somewhere. I'm imagining it's going to go after one of these, these little stacks. Uh, but we are in Pennsylvania. We are very close to Gettysburg itself. Doesn't seem to be concerning us at, at all at the moment. Wish I could add four smarts, but unfortunately not right now. Not at the moment. Keep this army relatively close. Um, why are you guys so enthusiastic all of a sudden? It's making gains. Gains on what? Let's say you're not making gains given the fact that we're actively occupying your land. Uh, let's go here. You guys march to the north. It's Pittsburgh. Yeah, there we go. How are you guys fast with us? Uh, great question. Yeah, there's a 23k stack. Uh, you might, you guys may be going for Washington. Uh, retake that. There you go. We caught you. Goodbye, Merc stack. Goodbye, 15,000 troops. Ready. There we go. That army just got dusted. Thank you for paying for that. Don't mind at all. Gonna wait for you guys to get movement locked, and we're gonna go fight here. Guys, have maneuver of six, so we are going to go ahead and suffer a movement penalty. Or the river crossing penalty. That just is what it is. Let's go over there. You guys are indeed going to Washington. Mm, I actually don't know where you guys are going at that point. Grant's down there. That's a good spot for him. Go. Another, what, 20,000 troops just gone and dusted. You still think you're making gains? I don't think so. I think I've ground you to a, to a pulp at this point. Uh, let's go after this little 20k stat. You guys go siege over there. That's fine. We're carpet sieging down a little bit faster. Alrighty. For Mexico... Or Ohio, not Mexico. Oof. That is a uh, much different area. You guys go for Ohio. Iowa, Michigan, Indiana, Illinois, cut in half, Wisconsin, Upper Michigan, Minnesota. That'll work. You guys are going to do the same thing. I would imagine you guys are going to Washington. No, you are not. All right, we go south then. Go take Kentucky, West Virginia, and then you guys go pop over there. That's fine. This army is going to march straight down south. Go say hi over here, and now you're on low, because you are not making gains, that is for sure. Where do we have rebels? Oh, Particulus. Uh, we could technically uh, consolidate and then go ahead and accept their demands, and we'll go ahead and get another uh, more manpower. Unfortunately, we are capped on our current force forces. In terms of quantities, maybe you guys will go fight them for me. I would be okay with that. Although you guys would probably lose if, I, if you guys actually fought us, which is kind of hilarious. You guys are building more troops. Interesting. Here, 64,000 men groups. You guys going to Atlanta? Yeah. Don't burn it down, please. Uh, just 
scared of that. This little little 1k stack that's going to walk into you with low morale. You'll be fine. Yeah, see? They second-guessed you. Uh, actually, if I can persuade you, like, push you uh, towards my rules, you actually go kill them. I'd be very enthusiastic about that. It looks like you're going straight to my rebels. My rebels are going to kick your butt is the problem. It's actually going to be pretty comedic, I think. Rebels should have our stats. Yeah. You guys are going to win, but that's okay. Thank you for dealing with my rebels. Oh, you get to go deal with all of my rebels. Thank you. That is the best thing that could have happened for us. Unfortunately, we... Not quite fast enough. If you have six maneuver, yeah, we're not going to catch you anytime soon. We are going to need to shift consolidate before we get in there. Actually, we pretty much already consolidated. 80,000. Let me just sit there. Let you guys suffer. Ah, uh, no, you guys have plenty of reinforcements. Go in. I imagine we could win this. It is Grant. He's going to cost us quite a few troops uh, here in this battle, but that's okay. American Separatists. No, no, no. There's a reason we separated. There you go. There you go. 14 to 10. All right, so that wasn't necessarily the best, but you guys are going to retreat south. versus. Actually, you guys are probably going to go straight to Washington. Go to Washington. They only have so... Yeah, there we go. Oh, no, unfortunately. You guys did not go to Washington. Oh, we'll, we'll go take Washington ourselves. Uh, it does look like our stacks are now kind of uh, in bad places. You guys can walk that way. Walk down to Louisiana. Um, you guys have reinforced or recruited enough troops to, to be an issue there. That's going to come back due to our fort. Fantastic. Uh, it's just going to take a sweet time. Uh, continue to retake this. Manpower is negative 7,000. Cool. This army, unfortunately, is going to be caught. Is a part of it. Okay. Those 2,000 men uh, served us uh, very greatly. Yeah, it was only 0.1 war score. Not too bad. There we go. We got second war goal back. 21% war score. Does not pay for us to take all this land. Maybe we don't take Oklahoma. We just take this one province to cut them in half, uh, officially. Uh, I want these two so that way I can go ahead and complete a mission. Because it's claim permanent claims. Secure our border. The border states. Uh, which is fine. I just... I technically don't need Maryland or Delaware. It, it, it just would have been nice. But that is also going to be quite a bit of development. Okay, I, I can concede that for now. Army's coming back over here. Great. No, didn't have enough money. Alright, well, that 1k stack is going to be able to do its job, I would imagine go another loan for us uh, we are running it every five months we're having to take another loan which kind of sucks go destroy that army and we continue on up there you guys are good there this army is gonna come over here to Nashville go that army not serve much of a chance and we only need 1k here so that'll be good Definitely don't need 2k stacks. 2k stacks is your carpet sieging your enemy versus your own, because you're not going to suffer attrition in your own land. Let's go. Go with the, the southern bit. Let's go. Perfect. Uh, rebels were Catholic rebels. Uh, hopefully the Union will go deal with that. I kind of doubt they will, but, you know, I can, I can always dream. You guys are movement locked without a leader. I couldn't ask for much more. Is that uh, another Merc stack? No, that is an, a legitimate army. Well, goodbye to 20k stack. To 20k troops. You went after this 1k stack. To the fourth. Yeah, you guys can be able to leave. The seventh. Alright, this little 1k stack is dead. That's fine. Got caught out. But we also killed a 20k stack, so 1k for 20k uh, seems like a pretty fair deal to me. Negative 100 and some reasons, cat. 
gonna continue on down south. This is my new troop that I just built. Yep. All right, you guys do that. Go do that. We'll be good. Uh, we're kind of gonna just have to leave those rebels by themselves. Going to sweep back across because there is yet another uh, 120,000 troops. Yep. All right. Well, there went a nice artillery piece, nice cannon emplacement. I wish I could take it for myself. Fortunately, that's not how. That Why is Crownland so bad? I guess that's fine for now. It does, it's not increasing our overall autonomy. That's okay. We're going back to Washington. We'll take it for ourselves. You guys... Oh, you guys took Washington. That's a bit annoying, but we'll take it. Not a big deal. As we continue to reoccupy our own land. Go, you guys do that. There is another... How much inflation do we have? Only one. I'm actually surprised that it's not higher. So we'll take Washington back in a heartbeat. Yeah, you guys can try and fight us. That's fine. Let's see if we can... What is this, Grant? No. We'll go fight here. This little 51k. That, that should weaken them pretty uh, pretty good. Who's scared? Because of that guy? Then, then don't go over there. Sillies. You don't have to reoccupy that. Go somewhere else. I'm telling you you have to go there. There you go. War score is going to continue to trend up in our favor. There's Washington for ourselves going you guys are going that way come on back i don't have to be concerned about our capital i have to be concerned about them coming over here and wiping our armies go do something like that my little army's alone Definitely, they say no oh we're up to 32 percent war score I think it is 69 reasons. Hmm. Yep. Alright, that one little 1k stack is dead. I think it's well worth losing that at this point. Um, let's see if we can catch this army. Are we capped on war score for battles? Yeah, we're capped on war score for battles. So, those don't even matter if we lose them. We're just here to destroy armies. Uh, so that way they're a little bit more likely to make peace. Let's go there. I mean, I don't really have to do battles at this point. I'd rather just do occupations. Although, just killing off more troops is all, always beneficial. This Grant? No. Who's this? Why is Grant all the way over here? Like, you guys keep swapping around, swapping them around. Can you stop? 35%. We are uh, negative 53 reasons. You guys are going there. We can fight you. It's coastline, too. Perfect. We outnumber you. Good. These are these are good odds for us. Alright, you guys are going there. You're going there. Go free Knoxville. Look at your army dwindle. I did roll a 9, though. That kind of sucks. But, yeah. Another 30,000 for 10,000. Uh, very easy trade uh, for us to make. Naval supremacy is definitely not something we have yet. Which... You guys are going to move there. Okay, that's fine. I think it's time we go ahead and take some more of your forts. Uh, I don't think I need to be concerned anymore. Thinking about this. Alrighty. Good. Down to 100,000 troops. I think that's okay. There you go. We'll just go occupy your two forts. We'll do two artillery barrages. And that should uh, pretty much end this war, I would hope. These two, it's pretty much fullest extent. You guys just go home. Go down to Florida. Uh, you guys can do that, and then we're going to send you back to Florida as well. Uh, just because you guys can go do little carpet sieges, but these two forts are going to be worth more than anything that you guys go occupy, so. Yo, good. 64%. Only have six artillery. Do I move the artillery to do an artillery barrage somewhere? I think so. I think we send it here, do the siege first. We don't have uh, enough bodies there. Don't have enough bodies here either. Oh, that's fun. 
Go ahead and do this one with the artillery, and then this will just continue that siege. Uh, 10,000 troops, that's too many for us to assault, for sure. Uh, if you're gonna leave the Deep South alone, we're good. Uh, can we go ahead and pick up... Production efficiency right now, is that something we want? Miami. Why does Miami have Separatists? That's, uh, that's a great question. Uh, yeah, we're losing only 40 ducats a month right now. So we're, 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 the economy is not in the worst place state. We are 20 ducats, so half of our deficit is just due to us, um, reinforcing. Or, uh, paying off our debt that we have accrued. Just, you know, it's a thing. It's kind of to be expected at this point you guys go there. Uh, we'll lose the army and navy tradition for now. That's okay. Uh, there we go. That's fine. Cav, we're gonna consolidate that as so, well. We don't. We have already had too much cav, so that's fine. Uh, not being able to do the siege though kind of sucks. What? What is this? Where's peace? That means I'm gonna have to fight Mexico. I have no interest in fighting Mexico right now. Not at all. How many troops do you have, in Mexico? 80,000 with 81,000 manpower? Yeah, I don't want to fight you, Mexico. Get out of here. Are you been a great power? No. Uh, you are our rival, so I guess that's a thing. Uh, if you join the war, this war will just end really quick. It's fine. It's a thing. Fly it goes to August. If we, if we just ignore it. Now there's an impending force, so I cannot make white peace. But I wanted to. Okay. Well, sure, we can go fight there then. We're going to ignore you. Okay, so you joined. That cost uh, a 7% war score. Cool. It's a thing. Uh, I definitely don't want to go deal with Mexico. Mexico's would be annoying. Wash losing Washington hurts though right now. Do that one last time so we can try and continue our sieges. Uh, getting one fort, I think, and then Washington is going to be enough. You just lose Lee. Where did you see Lee? Has been all... oh. What do you want? Why did you join the war? <laughs> the Mexicans intervened and then promptly left. No, we, we're still going to continue. Uh, we're okay. We're going to take this siege and then we're going to go over there. Manpower sucks still. Why is there a 51,000 American stack right next to me? Hold up. It's like you guys were coming down here to defeat my army and then uh, promptly went, Oh no, that's too strong, and then left. Uh... United you know, States embrace nationalism, realm of armies. You release yours of separatism reduction. Oh, you did just wipe one of my little 1k stacks. That's fun. That's cute. That's great. Good for you guys. Uh, are we reinforcing at all? That did not look like it counted for any war, war score. How many siege phases? We have had zero siege phases. They're great. Um. He's there. We're gonna pop you out over there for a second. Go reoccupy those. Not a big deal. Ugh. The U.S. is putting up a pretty good fight. We're gonna do our artillery project there. Are you military tech ahead of us? 81 to our... You are military tech ahead of us. Uh, what is that tech? What does it look like? Shock, infantry, fire. Well, okay, that is a huge uh, level. It's like a whole pip. I mean, that guy's pretty good. It's almost as good as Lee was. Manpower is, you know, it's coming in time, in turn. 
All right, you have just infantry. Just go occupy, really. Go take Jefferson Davis. You can go lead a lead uh, a, some siege or something. That's fine. Oh, good, you guys took care of our rebels for us. Thank you. Appreciate you. War score is in their favor right now. Uh, you're trying to do that siege. I don't. That's not going to go anywhere. Yeah, it's, it, you don't even have enough troops there to siege. Fantastic. There's 67,000 troops right here, so that is a third of your army right there. While we continue our sieges, uh, we're going to go to Washington after. What is this? Texas Separatists. Why is Texas trying to separate from us? Great question. Uh, you're going to get one army. One of the little stacks. Got a claim on that, I guess. Uh, I believe the U.S. Army is going to go deal with that, the other one, so I don't have to care about it. Six four leader, that is good enough. Uh, Grant is still alive. That's unfortunate. Uh, we're gonna have to bury Lee in a very ceremonial location. Uh, like we're we're in we're definitely in the north. Uh, I hate this. That's ugly. Uh, I do want the siege though. Like we have plenty of forts. We uh, granted we only really have three forts. Like why is there not a fort in uh? Louisiana, there should be a fort here. There should be plenty of forts. If they're only level 2, there should be forts. In theory. Go we'll take New York, one of the big populous centers. Be pretty easy for us. You guys carpet siege just again. All right, you're going to go deal with our rebels, though. Thank you. Do that one. Carry on. This fort is taking its sweet time. It's costing us four score. New Haven. How many troops are there? 7,000. Doing the Monarch points, that's fine. But, that is all the time that I have today. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys please like and subscribe. Have a wonderful day.